Hello, my name is Tomoko Kashiwagi. I am the assistant professor of piano and collaborative piano at the University of Arkansas. I have lived in the United States for 27 years and Fayetteville has been my home for the last eight years. My violinist, Miho Odasakon, is the principal second violinist of SONA, Symphony Orchestra of Northwest Arkansas, and she is also the artist in residence at Suzuki Music School here in town. She came to Fayetteville from Japan in 2008. Since I moved here, Miho has become not only my musical partner, but also like a sister. Between 2017 to 2019, Miho and I presented a series of sick concerts for violin and piano titled Inspired by Beethoven for the residents of Butterfield Trail Village. We love your concert hall and we love having you as our audience. Since the pandemic started, we had to suspend all in-person musical activities and we are very thankful that BTV has provided this opportunity to make music on stage together. We will each perform a piece on our own and later play two pieces together for you. Miho is going to start this concert with Fantasia No. 1 in B flat major by George Philip Telemann, written in 1735 for unaccompanied violin.
Hello, everybody. I just performed Fantasia Number no. One, composed by Jody Philip Tillman, who is a German composer and four years older than Johann Sebastian Bach. He was a very productive composer and composed about 3,000 pieces. However, unfortunately, half of his composition has been lost. Nowadays, Tillman's music is not performed very often compared to Bach and Handel's music. Personally, I'd like to say his music is like a hidden jewel, and I want to begin my new musical journey with Tillman's violin works. Now, I'd like to introduce the next piece. Tomoko is going to perform Ballad Number no. 3 by Frédéric Chopin. Tomoko's expert area of teaching is collaborative piano. She often says, we collaborative pianists also learn many things and can think music deeper through performing solo piano works. It is not enough, only learning chamber music or other collaborative pieces. Chopin was a true pianist. For example, when I play Chopin's cello sonata, the experience of playing his solo music helps to express the beauty, sensitivity, and gracefulness in his music. The ballad number three was inspired by a poem by Polish poet Adam Mickiewicz. By a beautiful lake, a boy and a girl met. They started being attracted to each other. However, the girl was Undine, a water nymph. Their love didn't end up being happy. Let's listen to this poetic and dramatic bird number three by Chopin. Let's welcome at Tomoko.
I am going to invite Miho back to the stage to join me now. When we started social distancing, musicians immediately started exploring computer programs and apps that let us continue playing ensemble pieces. This software allows us to layer recorded tracks on top of each other. Unfortunately, it really is not the same as what we are about to do. When we play together, we are listening to each other. We are trying to communicate. We respond to each other, being inspired in the moment. Berceau, or Cradle Song, Opus 16, was composed by Gabriel Fauré around 1879. This short, sweet piece was originally written for violin and piano. If we were to collaborate together using computer software, I would have recording the piano part, imagining Miho playing the violin. But when Miho would play along the recording I provide, she would be restricted to the timing of my playing with no flexibility. I am so glad that we are able to share this moment together to play this piece for you.
This is our last piece on this program. We are going to perform one of the most beautiful violin sonatas, Cesar Frank's Violin Sonata in A Major. The sonata was composed as a wedding gift for Eugene Izai, who was an incredible Belgian violinist. On the wedding day, Izai and his friend had a quick rehearsal and performed this sonata for the wedding guests. Izai loved Frank's sonata very much and performed it over the next 40 years of his life with various pianists and in many different places. The sonata received a lot of recognition and continues to be one of the most beloved violin sonatas today. Tomoko and I are going to perform the first and the fourth movement from the sonata. Hope you like it.
We hope you enjoy our performance. We look forward to coming back to play for you again in the near future. Thank you so much for listening.